Subscribe to Cookie the Main in the next 5 seconds and you'll get infinite luck and hatch 100 secret pets. I know I'm subscribing. Alright guys, so as many of you guys know, tomorrow we have a brand new update coming tomorrow. It's going to be a brand new world, which is going to be the candy world. And there's going to be a lot of new features there, such as the uh pen enchantments you know there's a lot of things they said they will be coming such as a traveling merchant i don't know that's going to come in this update but this video is going to basically tell you how to be prepared for that new world um also this is what the new world would look like and all the enchantments and stuff that are coming into the game and most likely those are going to cost gems so this video is going to show you how to get those gems the ores you would need and etc all that so you prepared for the candy world so yeah for the first thing you're going to need some gems um, for the easiest part, there's definitely some gems in the challenges, and you can restart this for only 900 gems. You get 3,000 if you have the two times game pass, and the, I think it's either 10% or 50% more gems from the season pass premium thing. So yeah, we have 3,000 from this, 6,000 from that, and I don't remember the rest, but yeah, there's definitely some gems in here, three times to get them. The season pass, obviously, you get like 700 from here. There's dead, there's obviously many ways people know how to get gems. I mean, I know a few like right here is like give eighteen thousand right then and there. There's are two ways. We have the also the factory, which it's that's basically the easiest way to grind gems, you know. Like ten ten thousand gems from the factory for two trillion each shells. So there you go. I made thirty thousand gems right there, just like that. And the gem genie might be doing some certain things or you're grinding for gems right here probably are going to be costing gems for enchantments like any other roblox game you see out there there's is going to be going to cost gems for some enchantments and stuff also for um to unlock the world you're most likely going to need reapers i know i said this in the previous video on how to prepare for atlantis but for sure i'm pretty sure this is time you're going to need some reapers and ores and obviously some uh shells I mean, I'm pretty sure I've seen a lot of people with a uh, quadrillion shelves, and I'm pretty close to that. I just need like 70 trillion more, but definitely gonna need some of that, and maybe some rebirths. I don't know, but yeah, maybe you're gonna get like at least 200 of each ore, just to make sure, because in the last uh up like level currently level two, which you needed to get to Atlantis, you needed a lot of ores from the Cyber Galaxy world, and a lot of people didn't know how to get them, so. If you guys don't know how to get them, there's definitely um, ways to find out. Like, for example, there is the wiki and on the Mining Simulator 2 wiki. But I'm pretty sure most of you guys know where everything's at. There's, like, only, like, four ores. We have the Cinnab... I think this is Cinnabar, the Coral, the Black Opal, and that Seagrass. Or I think there's actually five. I'm not pretty sure. I'm not really sure on how many... Yeah, there's actually five. So there's shells and seagrass. So there's only five uh, ores in the Atlantis world. So it shouldn't be that hard to find those either way. But yeah, I can't wait for this candy um, world update. And yeah, there's definitely, you only have like a, a day or two to grind. I mean, I already have 500,000 gems. I've been grinding ever since I spent all my gems on this egg. I've yet to hatch anything, so I just gave up. But yeah just save up your gems i'm gonna try to get like to 700,000 before tomorrow's update which is like around like 6 8 p.m est usually unless they're working on it early and they bring out the update like a little earlier than they will uh they usually will i mean the update did come out late for atlantis like it came out at like i don't know like 11 p.m est and i mean it was pretty cool pretty cool but yeah you're definitely gonna need some gems there's obviously ways to get gems. I've, I've said this in many other videos, like how to get infinite boost, the how to prepare for the Atlantis world. I mean, I just even showed you. And yeah. So yeah, so I would suggest stacking up on currency as well if there is going to be a traveling merchant. Because as you know, in BGS, we need currency to buy some certain pets or whatever that were in the traveling merchant. And you know, people were just spending days and hours trying to gain pets and stuff for those ores and people made shinies in those and those went for a lot of value i'm just saying oh so i'm pretty close to a million eggs so if i do get that i'll probably get a few gems for doing that uh where is it at million eggs where is that at yeah see if i do that i get twenty thousand gems so that's easily gonna get me to like five hundred thousand and an hour 30 minute boost also yeah you're gonna need some boost because there's gonna be some new pets with new stats and all that you're gonna want that as well 
uh but yeah mainly i'd say grind for the most popular not popular but like more powerful ores in atlantis like from dark coral depths uh, or city of gold and maybe seagrass because i i mean there's honestly i don't even know or maybe knowing preston not preston isaac the enchantments are probably gonna be uh what do you call those like the coins or whatever currency like the shell currency probably gonna cost that but i'm pretty sure it's mainly gonna be some what do you call it gems also i did see in the picture that i showed recently that there is going to be a candy factory so i don't know what that means like is that where you get the enchantments or is that like some type of new gem kind of factory or because i also did see like i'm gonna show you right now there is different color enchantments you could put on your pet be like that aren't stat wise like you just change the color of your pet maybe that's where you get that i mean that it would be cool but i don't know only thing i really know that really works is the shop and the cell also yeah speaking of shop you're gonna want to grind some more gems like I, i'm telling you this update's gonna need tons and tons of gems because there's definitely gonna be some new tools in the rebirth shop that are gonna be for the candy world and you're gonna need some gems to upgrade your tool etc i mean i have infinite backpack so i don't need to grind for the backpack but i just do need to grind for the tool because yeah also maybe this right here the sweet scoops might be related to the candy world maybe he was hinting at that i, I honestly don't know but yeah i can't wait for this update tomorrow definitely gonna live stream it but yeah that's pretty much the re like really ways to prepare for this update you're gonna need gems uh good pets boost definitely boost um i i don't know be on time i guess i mean there's you really just do need gems and the ores and rebirths that's literally all you will need for this new update like every other world but yeah definitely go ahead in the time you can go ahead and craft some of these uh shells into gems i mean this right here is like easily like 32,000 32,000 gems right there so yeah go ahead and do that while you can you have maybe like 24 hours or so when, when this video comes out to do so but uh yeah so yeah if you guys really enjoyed this video or it's helpful at all then make sure to leave a like and subscribe and turn on bell on so i post a brand new video also i'm pretty sure there will be some bgs pets from this uh bgs to this new update so definitely can't wait for that but yeah anyways guys peace if you enjoyed that video then you wouldn't mind watching another one of my videos on the left and right of the screen i also post every day so you don't want to miss out on those videos as well i do post pessimistic on my second channel which is right here now goodbye